like I'm lying like. Anyway, top of the morning to you ladies, my name is Jacksepticeye, and welcome to the Human Resource Machine. This is a game developed by the same people who developed Little Inferno, Little Inferno, which I fucking adore. You guys know how much I love that game. It was so awesome when it came out, and I really, really liked it, and I, I... I wanted to try out the new game that they made. I don't know if it's going to be as cutesy or as quirky as Little Inferno. It seems to be an actual se more serious game. Not with the humor or anything, just with the mechanics. It seems that it, it... I saw them mention something about coding, about task managing, so I don't know if I'm actually going to be able to do this. But we're going to get into play. I like this guy on the left. Just going crazy. A man after my own heart. Get back inside and go to work. Okay. Yes, please select your employee ID. Okay, employee one. Oh yeah, I got in to see what the game, how the game, or to see if the game recorded well. You always have to do that. As a YouTuber, you have to get in and see if games actually work before you start recording them. Mailroom, year one. Okay, what do I do? Welcome to your first day. You look like an excellent instruction follower. Your first job will appear over there on the right side in a moment. Remember, you can always ask me for help. Okay, drag commands into this area to build a program. Your program should tell your worker to grab each thing from the inbox and drop it in the outbox. What? Dra drag what in here now? Exactly? Hello again, tell me more. Give me an example. If your inbox is 867, your outbox should be 867. Okay, my... it's empty. Drag commands into this area. Okay, where are my commands? Please. You can't paste that here! It does not appear to be a valid program! I'm sorry! Do I have to click these? Can my little dude move? No. Okay, tell me more. You can put together a list of commands. Okay. Over there on the right side, press the big green play button. Watch what happens. What will happen? Office life truly is unpredictable. Full of surprises. I've been here 24 years. Yes, thank you. One day you can be just like me. Like, miserable? <laughs> Get back to work. Okay, there is no, like, big giant green play button. Oh. Okay, if I double-click inbox, that happens. Run your program whenever you're ready. Okay. Not enough stuff in the outbox. Management expected a total of three items, that's zero. Okay. Step back and debug. Okay, so do I have to put in three? One, two, three. Oh, maybe I take those three from inbox and then put three in outbox. No, okay, no, stop, stop, go back. Okay, let me figure this out. I think I know what to do. Like, inbox, outbox, inbox, outbox. Does that work? Yeah! Okay, so that's how I do it. That's how the game actually works. You're, you're setting up a list of commands. That's what they were saying. If you're like... Is that good? Yeah! You look like Miss Nancy! Your presence is requested on the next floor. Fucking sweet! So, they were saying that this was like a, a gamer coding kind of thing. Because you like, you set up a list of commands, a list of codes. And then, or just coding in general. And then you execute, and if something goes wrong, you have to go back and debug and see what the hell went wrong. So, it's kind of cool in that way. I don't know if I'm going to do a full series on this, because... Ooh, I want to get to coffee time. Because this is something that's going to get really complex, and my brain can't do these things. I'm not good at these kind of things. But I just wanted to check out... Busy mailroom. I wanted to check out what the game was like, anyway. Well, looks like you've made it this far. Congratulations on your promotion. Most people stress out and quit before making it this far. But I can tell you of a bright future in inbox outbox management. Here is your new assignment. Okay. Grab each thing from inbox and drop each into outbox. You got a new command, you can drag jumps arrow to jump to different lines within your program. What? I have no idea what that did. <laughs> okay, let's go back. Let's, uh, let's stop this and go again. Well, you back there, and then we go... Am I supposed to put these in a, a certain order? Then we go inbox, outbox, inbox, outbox, inbox, outbox. I have no idea what I'm doing. Okay, walk faster. Oh, whoosh! Oh, not enough stuff in outbox. Management expected a total of ten items, not four. Okay, so we need ten of these. I only have... I only have four so far. Well, I have eight... I have eight lines, but there's only four inbox ones, so I have to get it up to twenty. I... I think. This should be enough, right? Oh, whoosh! Whoosh! Look at the speed of me go! I'm so awesome! Not enough stuff in outbox. Management expected a total of eleven items, not ten. You didn't... You better be right this time! Yeah, I did it. What was that all about? Yeah, fucker. Busy mailroom. Done. King of verbosity. 
pretty nice. Miss Nancy is really just writing down all the shit. She's saying that I'm amazing. I have great hair and a great ass. Miss Nancy, outside the workplace, please. In here, it's considered sexual assault. Sexual harassment, that's the word I'm looking for. Copy floor, okay. You like this music? Really fills my soul. Okay, copy floor. Year three. I'm in my third year? Oh, maybe this is where the jumps come in. Oh no! The inbox conveyor system is completely broken. But that doesn't mean we get to take a break from work. Ignore the inbox for now and just send the following three letters to Outbox. Okay. This is where shit gets complicated because facilities management staff has placed some items over there on the carpet for you. If you're either way, you can pick them up. Okay, so what do I do? Put in a jump and see what happens. Nothing. Okay, I don't get this yet. I don't get it. I don't get it. Oh, so the jump goes around the things. So I can like skip over some. Oh, okay. I get it. Okay, so how do I grab, how do I grab like a three? How do I grab the G? Because th he said he wants bug, right? So I need to put it like G-U-B instead of B-U-G. Bzz, bzz. Hello, maintenance department. Our conveyor system is completely broken up here. Productivity is down 40%. Yes, mm-hmm, yes, clearly. We see about that. Click. Well, maintenance department says there's work of fine down there. Either way, I, I fucking keep changing his voice. Okay, so it says to ignore my inbox for now, so... What does co- Oh! Oh! And then the outbox. And then copy from... You! And then outbox. And then copy from... B! To outbox. Okay, play that and see what happens. There's a G. But outbox management expected B, but... Ah, fuck. So I do have to do with that one. Well then. So we have to... You're supposed to be G. You're supposed to... You're fine. And you're supposed to be B. Okay, now we got it. Now we got it. Oh, little dude! Oh! So it, it matters... It's loud! It matters how they go in, not the form of how I see them. Got it! That makes actual sense. What was I talking about before? Okay, I'm getting it. Scrambler Handler. That should be my superhero name. Up there, in the sky. Is it a bird? Is it a plane? It is a plane. And on that plane... Is the Scrambler Handler! Dr. Bees! If you haven't looked up the Dr. Bees animation, you should. It's fucking hilarious. <laughs> Scrambler Handler, here we go. Come here, fist system is fixed. I'm just in time for you to get to work. The data won't collate itself. Grab the first two things from the inbox and drop them in the outbox. In the reverse order, repeat until the inbox is empty. What? You get a new command, feel free to copy to... Wherever you like on the carpet, it will be clean later. So grab the first two things from the inbox and drop them in the outbox in the reverse order. So I have to grab two and eight, but put them in as eight and two. Okay, so you grab inbox and you copy to here. Then you grab from inbox and you copy to here. And then, ah. Uh, okay, I know I have to run it and then figure out what's wrong. So I grab you, put you there. Great, grab you, and put you there. Yeah, so then I have to figure out how I actually do this. Now, can I debug? Okay, so then I copy from here into outbox, and then I copy from here into outbox. Right? And then I should be able to copy and paste all that. Three times. Your program is now on the clipboard. Try pasting it into other rooms, or emails, or notepad, or anywhere. The possibilities are endless. Are you sure you want to clear everything and paste? You cannot undo this action. Yes. Can I not paste it underneath and get a load of them? Okay, wait, we just see if this works first. So you grab one. That's great, throw away that. Then you grab eight. Cool, then you grab eight and you put it in there. Then you grab one, and put it in there. Cool, okay, that's not perfect yet, that's just my scenario. And then do I have to clear these? This is getting confusing. And then outbox and then copy from there to outbox. That should be it. I think that's the complete sequence. Let's see if I'm right. Is that it? Is that it? Did I do it? Yeah! Okay, this is a lot of fucking shit to remember. But it's cool, because you get to like... Do your sequence, figure out if that works, just to, like see how your little guy moves around, and then you go back in, and then you just add more to it. I probably could have done that a lot easier 
instead of putting down all the things. Oh, coffee time! Oh, year five, and I finally get some coffee. Hello, girls! How are you ladies doing? Do you have a mustache? Oh no, maybe it's the drinks you guys have. You all look like you have mustaches. Oh, they're your lips. No, I don't like that you actually have voices. I wanted to do the voices. This is cool! <laughs> Oh no! Local authorities are investigating. Oh no! Seems like there's a big story going on in the background of this one as well. The big story in the back of Little Inferno was one of the best parts. When you got to the end of it, it was like, holy fuck! So I don't know if I'm actually going to get to the end of this. Because there's a lot of shit. Can you imagine how hard it's going to be up here? Can I click on it? Try it out? Okay. Let's try a few more. Oh god. This is a fun game though. It's really... It's a really, um, complex game when you get into it. Tripler room, octoplier room. Is that an octopus, markiplier? Um, okay. Rainy summer! I don't like rainy summers. Ugh! Welcome to my personal rain cloud. I was ever very good at math, since I own have only three fingers in each hand. <laughs> but I hear you don't actually need to know very much about math to complete these assignments. For each two things in inbox, add them together and put the result in outbox. You got a new command, it adds the contents of a tile on the floor to whatever the value you're currently holding. So do I add the things together and it'll make up like, it'll make up nine on its own, or do I have to put in nine? Okay, for each two things in add box, in box. Okay, so inbox, copy to here. Inbox, copy to here. Cool. And then add you with, and add you and then put them in outbox. Let me see how this works. You put down a seven, you throw it away. You put down a two, you throw it away. You add seven and two, you make a nine. Oh, 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 oh no. Bad outbox. Okay, there we go. Now I get it. So, you don't, you, you take away this guy. Your program is on the clipboard. Try pasting it into other programs or rooms. Okay, can I paste it into, wait. Can I actually paste it into like notepad on my computer? I'm gonna copy and paste it a bunch of times and now paste in here. Yeah! Holy crap! That's cool! So I actually have to go into the notepad on my computer and copy and paste a bunch of shit. That might be too many times though. I don't I don't know if it matters. Fucking genius! Haha! <laughs> Woo! Hello, Miss Redhead! Miss Fiery Redhead! Well you're kind of a brown. You're not writing stuff down though, you're just checking your hair. Um cool! I did not know I actually had to use my notepad on my computer. That's insane. Where do you see yourself in five years? Don't say doing your wife. Don't say doing your wife. Don't say doing your wife. Uh, doing your son? <laughs> were they always there? Maybe they were and I just didn't see them underneath my thing. Or ten years. I have a note here from your other boss that says, from this point on, your performance will be evaluated with extra scrutiny. What a treat. <laughs> okay, send all things that are not zero to the outbox. Right. You got a new command, it jumps only if the value you are holding is zero. Otherwise, it continues to the next line. Okay, so we go to inbox, we go to outbox. Send all the things that are not zero to the outbox. Okay, so there's six. Go to inbox, and then we copy to here. Because that's a zero. That should be good. Nope, there's another zero. Fuck. Aha! Your solution works with those specific inputs, but it fails on other possible inputs. Yes, here. I give you some inputs that cause your solution to fail, so you can see for yourself. I figured out how the jump if zero thing works. So, we get the two, outbox. We get the zero, then you jump on, the, you throw it away, you jump on the next one, which is a minus one, and that goes to outbox. I think. And then, okay, then it's inbox, outbox. Let's see if you work. Are you the solution? Shit, shit, shit. No, there's another zero. That's good. Then floof, floof. Duh, yeah, but there's another input. God diggity dang it. Okay, that one's pissed me off. I'm gonna go to the tripler room. I'm gonna see what the hell this is. I was only went to the other one because it went on to the next area. Who are you? This optional area is for high performing employees only. Is that you? Well, you're late. Seven years late! We need to make some changes around here! I want to see a 100% performance increase! From this point on, your performance will be evaluated with extra scrutiny! Well, fuck you, bitch! Okay, for each thing in inbox, 